Okay, students. Welcome again to e-commerce e lecture. Last lecture, two lectures uh, in e-commerce applications. We understood about uh, e-finance and some parts of or uh, some information about uh, e-marketing. In this lecture, we continue with the uh, e-marketing, remaining things. It is e-finance. E-finance is nothing but a location, implementation, and treatment of financial services through internet or internet technology. And e-finance, in simple words, is use of internet and technologies in financial services, which we are enjoying every day. Okay, internet. Okay, students. And here it is of e finance. Uh, objectives of e finance also. Then, what are the services that are offered to e finance? And what may be the technologies which are used through, used by e finance? Payments are there, securities, capital markets, banking, insurance. Okay. At the time of COVID, the insurance corporation accepted all. Premiums are paid through electronic mode. Policies are generated in it. Recently, ARDA also DA issued a note that all e policies has to be issued. Advantage to customers, advantage to government. What is the advantage to government? Employment generation. Banking, banking system is computerized. There is a need for back-end operations and uh, application generation, transaction processing. For this purpose, bank has given the Work to the private uh, compute private uh, software companies. So software companies recruited the people like you. And employment is generated. HDFC Bank given a contract to Infosys. I think it's Infosys. The contract for four thousand crores for some years for maintaining all the. You know, ICT information and information and communication technology. Everything. D is a general electric. Gen factor. Gen factor is a backbone for the State Bank of India transactions, either credit card or banking transactions. That is past, I think, present, either it may be continuing or not. So employment is generated. Competition in the market is increased. Global Trust Bank, present later it is Oriental Bank of France. Now it is Punjab National Bank, which introduced technology in banking. Later all the banks adopted those technology into their service. In the same manner, one bank is offering balance inquiry, others also offering balance inquiry. For that, they have to approach some software companies. Automatically, competition is increased, employment will also increase. Contribution in GDP of the country. Yeah, already told in earlier video. Once upon a time, 53% of GDP is from agriculture. That was now presently 19%. Now 53 plus percentage of the GDP is getting from service sector. The service sector which we in first slide we look at all this comes under service sector. Okay. In that one is a banking. Okay. Helpful in poverty elevation. Elevate poverty the best Suitable medicine is increase the employment. Increase the employment, government of India chooses to 
computerized every sector or every, or every activity, then automatically software and hardware and computer related jobs will increase. Okay. That is helps to government. And e-marketing which is nothing but buying and selling and all applications related to the market through electronic media or internet are called as e-marketing. Marketing of products using electronic technology to determine the consumer market. The activities to www with the aim of attracting the new business between the current development is uh, an identity that is e-marketing. Nature of e-marketing, features of e-marketing, difference between, this is very important question. Difference between traditional and the electronic marketing is, uh, is very important. The scope of e-marketing objectives also we discussed. Now looking at the information Importance of e-marketing also role of e-marketing and coming to the advantage of e-marketing reduces the cost. Earlier, marketing is uh, taking place through the uh, symposiums, mailers, door campaign which need the human capital and uh, human capital as well as uh, more investment. Investment is required. Presently, electronic marketing is taking place through internet, mobile, blogs, and, uh, email, Facebook, social media. So, due to this, one advertisement will reach to many people with the same cost. Earlier, when you are advertising in uh, Hyderabad and in similar manner you are advertising Vijayawada or in Delhi, so there will be additional costs from place to place. But you are in Hyderabad, you created a blog that will reach to throughout the world only with the creation of cost and uh, releasing it on the social media automatically, it will reach to everywhere. There is no outbounds have to controlling the reaching of your address. So, cost, in the case of cost, it is a very less or reducing cost. Convenience. Okay. When, when, when you want to advertise door to door, it is possibly between 10 to 4 ohm. 10 to 4 ohm. When you want to advertise, advertise through symposia, only on particular day or particular time, it is possible. But here it is, whenever the customer is having the time or the person who is viewer having the time, he can visit your website and he can read about your product profile and he can browse whatever the information it is related to your product which he want to buy. So, there is no time bound for that. So, e-marketing is 24 by 7 and it reaches to each and everyone. Reach to each and everyone. Then innovation. Earlier, earlier uh, it is only photographs can be possible to send. When the internet was started, just JPG pictures about the product they used to send. So when the communication barriers are reducing one by one, now they make into videos. Later, three. Later, now one, now when the new approach is coming, AR and VR, augmented reality as well as a virtual reality. Augmented reality in the sense you can draw a line into into your home and you can make it. To, Make it make or you can take a snap that the real was line was really entered into your virtual reality is presently used by the real estate companies and you can sit at your home 
you can sit at your room and you can see a 3 bit HK flat. By personally, you will visit bedroom, hall, kitchen, everything by personally. That real experience you will get. So, changes in the marketing was uh, one by one, it is changing. Okay, we are, uh, it is changing means because of the innovation. Okay? Advantage over uh, competitors. Competitors are changing their strategies. That is advantageous to follow the same or and uh, with the improved methods. We would like to uh, greater flexibility. 24 by 7, any time, in any platform, you can reach to the customers with a greater flexibility. Marketing research, marketing research, in the sense, so the statistics which we are getting, or the statistics which we are getting, help us to reach to the, reach to the customers, help us to reach the customers or change our strategies to reach out to the So, marketing research is one of one topic that uh, to frame our policies day by day or according to the product to product and improve customer interactions. Improve the customers' in interactions. Once goods were sold or before sold, pre or post days, and we, we, we ask our uh, People to contact or make a relationship with the customer and customer presently because of the innovations and reduce the call costs and internet is also very become very fast and we can chat with the customer care executives or company executives at any level any level and we can clarify our doubts and we feel very comfortable to buy a particular product or get service with the product. That is one advantage with the marketing. Improve service automatically. You know, if the relation between the customer and the company is very close, all the hurdles between these two people will be reduced to maximum extent. Automatically, sales will increase, service will also increase. Sales initiation. New markets and uh, business partners. Just imagine the Geo. Geo started with the uh, with uh, just a telephone. Okay. And with the Geo customers base, it is introduced its app. Geo Geo app is there, I think. Okay. In that you will find each and every one. TV, okay. And Geo Mart now. Geo Broadband. Maybe later what it will come. So, which helps the e-marketing to get the new market as well as the business partners. Partners Because of Geo, which is expanding its base, expanding its base, then Google, I think, Google or some other companies, foreign companies, they invested 45 to 56,000 crores in you know, Geo. Reliance. Okay. So, markets and partners may be increased. These are the advantages of e-marketing. Then coming to the disadvantages of e-marketing, dependability on technology. Once, once upon a time, there is a one cable is there from Singapore to India is laid uh, in Arabian Sea. Because of uh, a ship which dashed that cable that was cut into two pieces, in India, India for 12 hours or 24 hours, I am not sure about that one. Okay, total internet was down, downsized or no internet. So then our e-marketing will be, marketing will be affected. If we, total e-marketing is starts with E, it depends upon technology. No internet connections can cause difficulties. Before Geo, all we experienced, all we experienced,
all we experienced a very slow internet very slow internet at that time also e marketing is there e banking is there even still we continued with that one after 4g technology 4g technology after 4g technology then each activity related with e for in a fast pace the fast pace okay now 5g if the 5g came then we have to dream how the activities which starts with e will be okay so they are they are assured that one movie can be downloaded one movie with 3 hours movie can be downloaded within fraction of seconds or within minutes less than 5 or less than 2 or 3 minutes so then imagine that increase with the 5g technology the experience of e or e related activities will be security and privacy issues even how the electronic marketing or electronic related activities are increasing growing day by day in the same manner pricing conspiracy okay and theft of sensitive data it is also issue that's why it is not possible to attract a class of people those who are fear about the security maintenance cost due to constantly evolving environment that is very very much related uh, to the electronic market or electronic industry so when the 2g is there then 3g came so upgrading the 2g equipment with the 3c is not possible now they have to newly invest for the 3g when the 3g is uh, there then again 4g came then again uh, shifting the total hardware and the base that is also problem to that now 5g next 6g maybe 10g like that so that is one of the threat to the this e marketing because when once the amount the crores of amount is invested and that will become um, that will become useless when the technology was changed with the other thing high transparency of pricing and increased price competition that is one of the disadvantage high pricing higher transparency of price you see them some items were priced for more and offered for less and there is also more companies are electronic goods china is the ruler among the world for supplying the electronic type items for less cost Okay. when the mobile phones are introduced to nokia is the leader then automatically with the software android software china companies are manufacture the mobiles and they offer for 4000 3000 a smart mobile where buying a smart mobile is more than 18 or 20000 like that okay worldwide competition through globalization when i created a website in india in hyderabad that has to face with the global information which is available through the disadvantage to the consumers is the risk of for the fake account and hackers and direct payment to the credit card or pre delivery assignment consignment exposed to any of the before mentioned types of fraud so still many many people okay based on this one risk of burglary 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 means uh, thefting the data fake account creation even government uh, government officials accounts uh, in the name of government officials also fake mails were sent and they were used to get the information exposed to any aforementioned types of fraud that is possible okay credit cards fear of safety and of the transactions and data privacy do not physically meet sellers one disadvantage is we cannot get physical experience 
Many users still do not trust in electronic methods of payment. Whether you believe or not, okay, I won't download it or use Google Pay before last three years on, two years on, last two years only, before last year only, I use, I downloaded Google Pay. The problem is, I don't know whether the money will be transferred to them or for convenient of others, I am using, I am using Google Pay. Okay, and not having the opportunity to touch feel that is we cannot uh, get that. Okay, that is not possible because this is electronic. Even though we are unable to touch feel and try the products, companies are trying to supply and companies are trying to um, make experiences about the product by giving three dimension pictures, videos like that. Distrust by not having a physical support for transaction, fear of guarantees. Even companies, the marketing companies or the selling companies are try to get the trust among the customers. And uh, even though guarantee is not there, people are able to get the products. And uh, e commerce is uh, 8 lakhs or 9 lakh gross business. Every day, day by day, it is improving is improving and it is increasing. Now it is coming to the GST in India. And it is increasing day by day. Not only the one activity is in all type of activities. Coming to the limitations of e-marketing outright scams. That is that is happened in India and in other countries also. So that, that percentage is very less. Consumer is unable to physically peel or try on the product, not possible. Marketer will not be able to use the personal touch back to human. Peel, touch the product is not possible. Technology limitations also there. Low connection speed, that is the technology limitation. Compilation, that is it's not a limitation. It is possible for compiling with the other products. And even customers are, customer care executors also help us uh, in comparing with the other product. Some online shopping site with their average, Flipkart with their average rating is uh, 4.76, Traders is 5.32, Future Bazaar, Infibeam, Home Shop 18, it is very long one Home Shop 18 is, and uh, AP, Snapdeal, BuyThePrice.com, for the understanding only the truth, this was given. Online marketing is a search engine marketing will continue growing in double digits in the next three years. Already two it is having a base of nine lakh crores business in a year. In India, it may be year by wise, year by year. There is an increasing number of households using the internet and the search engines. For this purpose, we have to say hands of the China mobiles as well as Geo. Geo helps the India India for cheaper internet and China mobile companies are offering the gadgets for less price. With the SIM of Geo and with the less less cost to smartphone, we are able to experience the worldwide products and services. Right. Later, next video. We will discuss about D two visa. My students, next class we will understand about the.